Yeah, I'm in Gotham City in the Batmobile. Even though it get crazy, niggas don't talk like Swayze. All right, all right. Let's start right here. Yeah, we can start right here. What up? This is Swayze. You already know. I'm back with some more premium news from the towns. Now, last time we spoke on See How I Watch, right? His father had um a few things to say. Well, it wasn't necessarily him. He reposted what someone else had to say, and it was a lot of um cryptic messaging within that post that he put in his stories. And since then, you know, people were speaking on if it was a possible DOA sacrifice, the situation that happened with Siha Watts. Since certain people haven't been shouting him out, saying his name or showing him some respect or their condolences since his passing in his songs, I mean, in their songs. Well, that's what brings us here today, right? Because it seems like See How Watts Pops is just done. He's fed up and sick and tired of the fake love that certain people are showing, knowing that his son and those individuals had problems when he was alive. Now, I'm going um, to take us to See How Watts Pops. Instagram where he said it. Let's go there real quick. All right. Now, if you're not aware, Dougie B put up in his stories, um, R.I.P. See how I white. Had a picture with him. See how I watch. I believe that's flock. You know, just a nice old picture with all of them together, right? He put up R.I.P. And it looks like See How I Watch Pops had a problem with that because he took to his Instagram and he said this. I won't allow you to use my son as a mockery. You know, like I know, my son wasn't feeling you before he died. And you know what's up. Stop playing with me and my family. R.I.P. Siha and niggas who did what they did. And niggas know who did what they did. F clowns, this post is a slap in the face. That's when he tagged Dougie B. He said, rest easy, son. And let's stop the fake love. Everything for Siha. Now, when I first saw this, I said, damn. This is like, you know, some very riveting, compelling, tantalizing news right here. Because before there was just rumors going around like, yeah, see how Watts and like Dougie, you know, wasn't really cool with each other and this, that, and the third. And also, you know, there was just, you know, the whole Asian doll rumor saying that Nazi BK told her that Dougie B set up CI and this, that, and the third. All that stuff was going around. But it seems like see how Watts Pops just confirmed that he's not messing with Douglas Bernard Jr. in no way, shape, or form. So that's interesting. Now, after this was posted, um, you see Tiny B, she comes into the comment section. She said, nah, come on now, Unc. This is OD. Let's see the replies for that. Yeah, somebody said, uh, uh, uh. See how I was it, bro, if the police can't find out what makes you think you can, then Tiny B, I mean, then see how I responded to Tiny B and said, I respect the hell out of you. I can't allow this kid to show fake love to my son. It's a slap in the face, in my family's face, when we know what we know, feel me? Niggas know what happened to my son and won't even tell his mother, but go online and show fake love. It's whack, Tiny, on God it is. Me and his mother been waiting to find out what happened to our son for going on two years. And this nigga posts this shit. It's a slap in our face. Wow. So it seems like, um, according to um, See How I Watch Pops, there's information that's being kept from his family. 
According to him, they know something. They are aware of certain things. And instead of um, giving C.I. Watt's family the closure of knowing these things, I, I guess them showing this fake love is not really, you know, giving that they care like that. I, I guess that's where see how watch pops is coming from. And he keeps on saying, you know what's up. And niggas know who did what they did. Meaning that they must have some knowledge, prior knowledge on what really happened to see how watch. And his pops feels like they're not moving according, you know what I'm saying? Like accordingly with that information. This is what I'm getting from that. Now, if you guys don't remember, right? If you don't remember, this whole thing started, bro, because of Queen Dougie Von Flock Jr., bro. This is this is this is where this thing started from. Queen Dougie Von Flock, bro. If you don't remember exactly what happened, this is what happened. Look, we're gonna go to P Films real quick. Listen to what um, Nas EBK had to say. But tapping into our interviews. If you ain't tapping in, you tapping out. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the bell for post notifications. Man's that's dead. And and then after, you know, a few more posts and then, you know, y'all going live and it gets crazy. And then mm -hmm. y'all both say some intense things to one another. Yeah. She starts telling you, you know, get back for your man's that's dead. And, and she says <laughs> that, she says she that, you know. Crazy. That you said that Dougie B lined CI. I think that to I was like, whoa. Like, that's Yeah here, yeah here. Queen Dougie Vaughn Flock 41 804 inside the sweepers G's. She is, she's the one that said Nazi BK told her that Dougie B lined up CI. Like that's the shit that really killed me. Like that's why I really. I you was, know, I, I was gonna I was, ask you. I was, I was, I was just like, I'm on a live. I'm like, yo, bro, what? Like, she, you just said what? Like yeah. that's what I was trying to tell you. Like that's something you could Can't never take back. back. Like gotcha. that's why that bond with me is quiet. Yeah. It would never happen again because you over a fallout. If you mm -hmm. could do that on a fallout and just start fuck all that, a marriage, all that, that right there. Like yeah. you basically trying to incriminate me. On the media, even though you're not calling the cops or nothing like that, you basically telling the cops, oh, da 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 da, on the media because they're gonna see it. Yo, and this is the crazy thing. Y'all remember this time? This is when um, Nazi BK was messing with Jada Kingdom and um, Dougie B was messing with um, Queen Dougie Von Flock. Jeez, you feel me? And it seemed like a, a great thing, you know? They was double dating. Yo, bro. Nazi BK locked up right now, too. Yo, I know Nas is missing Jada, bro. Yo, she had him all over the world. She was putting rollies on his wrist, Cartier's, got him a P5. Once I saw her get him the P5 for his birthday, I said, now that's a real woman. That's a real woman. I know Nazi BK thinking about that. Damn, man, I, I would be, too. I would be too. Mm -hmm. We not, we not, we not like for me. Niggas is not stupid, bro. Like you get what I'm mm -hmm. trying to say. If we DOA, like you got to think about it. What's going on right now? Why yeah. so and shit like that? Like yeah. thing you're not watching. Niggas is crazy, bro. Yeah. So for her doing that is out of pocket, and niggas is certain niggas are still around and shit. And it's like yo, pff, wow. I don't even know what to tell niggas, bro. I should, I just find everything funny, so I just yeah. laugh. Cause she had myself, mistake. like. Cause she had mistaken something you said. I actually never spoke to her about that situation. Cause Jesus it's so Christ. real. Like after that situation, niggas don't even know. Y'all think we fell out at that time. Yeah. We been fell out before that. Gotcha. It, that's when it went to the media. Okay. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Like that's when it went to the media. We yeah. fell out literally like I'll say a week before see how I died. So it was like Bro was still alive when me and her fell out. Yeah. So she was not even around me. So it's like, how you heard that? It wasn't yeah. from me. Yeah. Probably them niggas she be around now. Like, I and that's the thing. That's the thing right there, right? <clears throat> <clears throat> I 
I was speaking to see how I watched Pops. And I did say to myself, well, I mean, not say to myself, while I was speaking to him, I said, Asian doll had to hear this from somewhere, though. You get what I'm saying? She had to hear it from somewhere. Don't get me wrong. Queen Dougie Von Flock is toxic. She everywhere she goes, you know, she's like a succubus. She every everywhere she goes, things just kind of go left. You get what I'm saying? However, do I think Asian Doll just pulled this out of her ass out of nowhere? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. And I and I heard that Dougie B really is the one who lined up see her. You think she just pulled that out of her ass like out of nowhere? I don't think she just just thought of that out of thin air and said, you know what? Yeah, I'm going to use that to um cause, like, you know, some, some um, you know, some type of, um, damn, there's a certain word I'm looking for. You guys probably could say it, but I'm trying to cause some type of um devastation. That's not the word. That's not the word. That's not the word. Mm, gain traction? No, no, that's not what I'm looking for. Cause disdain? I guess, yeah. I'm trying to cause some disdain within, you know what I'm saying, the deal. Hey, hey, hey. Trying to mess it all up. So I'm going to just say this. I don't think that's the case. I think she got it from somewhere. I do think she got it from somewhere. Where did she get it from? I don't know. She said it was Nazi BK. Nazi BK says he didn't. He didn't say that. So Asian Doll needs to just keep it a book. Where did she get that information from? Because according to See How I Watch Pops, bro, the information, like, is, is a little credible. This is, this is what, you know what I'm saying? He's saying himself. I don't know. I really don't know. I really, I don't know. I really want to know where she had that from. That's why I told her, yo, put it on King Vaughn. Yeah. She, she couldn't. And even if she did, she capping. Yeah. Cause it's like, see how father literally went on live yeah. and addressed it. I was gonna, like, I was gonna speak on that too. I was, I didn't even know what happened. I called see how pops like, yo, what happened? Like, what's going on? on so we, how, we, how, yeah, I'm, we, how I'm, I'm gonna be the there, one that's going for me? Say that, yeah, we gonna get there. We gonna get there, but it's just I, confusing. I you know, know. W when she said that, for you feeling like that's not true, like how, how did that make you feel? Cause I know for me, if somebody said that, I mean, that would have hurt me. Like how that made me feel? Like it didn't really hurt me or get to me because. Word, word of everything, like, see how he really know. Like, even when bro was alive, I was trying with bro, like, trying to get him in the studio. Like, mm -hmm. his pops know I was trying to hope. That's why his pops really fuck with me. Because it's Absolutely. like, I was really, bro was in jail doing, coming home on the weekends and shit. Feel me? I was trying to help bro out. His girl know, everybody know. Like, All right, but you guys get it. You guys get the drift. You guys get my drift when it comes to that. So, basically, you know, that's what's been going on. That's what been going on. And Nazi BK, you know what I'm saying? Seems like a um, stand-up guy, you feel me? Seems like a stand-up guy. He was like one of the first to hit up, see how I watch Pops to see what's going on and this and the third. When it comes to Nazi BK saying that Dougie B is the one who lined up, see how, I don't believe it. However, Asian Doll did not come up with that out of nowhere. Someone was, someone was talking to her, bro. Someone was talking to her. That's a fact. But yeah, you know, very sad situation, very sad situation. 